Hey everyone, we wanted to provide a quick instructional video for how to install your Revolt. We will be following the instructions that come with the Revolt, and the first step is to remove the Velcro straps. So there are three attachment points, one on the right side here, one on the left side. There's also a strap on top, and we removed that clip, so what are you going to do? And then you want to remove the front clip of the Vive, and you do that by sliding it forward, and then pulling it back. Here you'll be able to remove the audio cable, the HDMI cable, USB, and power cable. You'll be left with a naked Vive, ready to have a revolve put on it. So you want to take the revolve, place it on top of the Vive, turn the clip up, and turn the knob to lock it in place. Then go to the other side, turn the other side up, and lock the second side in place. It might take a little bit of uh, additional force, but it should be nice and tight. Next, you will want to pass the cables through the cable hook. And make sure the front clip is brought to the cable hook. Then plug back in the HDMI, the USB, and the power cable. Then it's time to install the audio cable. First, we'll remove the Velcro padding in the front. Then take the audio cable, push it through the front, and slide it through the HTC cover. Not that way, but the other way. Then reattach the front cable cover by sliding it back in. Now you'll want to attach the left and right side to the inside of the Revolve. You'll notice the right side has a little nubbin with an R on it. So you'll slide it under the audio cable hooks and it'll kind of be like your uh, flossing teeth if you will. So you'll just slide it underneath there and fill the lock into place. Same goes for the left side. Once both those sides are locked in, reattach the foam. And if the cables came out of the cable hook, reattach that. Now you have a vibe that's ready to use. Also, don't forget if you want the extra field of view, use a six millimeter padding from VR cover that's included with your revolver.